Hey guys, this is Arvir. Welcome to my gaming channel. This is where I do all my gaming. If you have not subscribed, make sure to subscribe and turn on the notification. And let's get into the video. So guys, today we are going to be building a tower in Minecraft. Really easy, really fast. And I'm even going to edit the tower. So guys, I even changed my avatar in Minecraft. So guys, to build this easy tower, all you need is cobblestone and a bucket of lava and a bucket of water. That's all you need to build this tower. So first what you do is one, build up high in the air because it's a tower so it has to be high. And guys, I even thought of upgrading my channel a bit. So now, um, I am actually gonna be posting every two day um, a video on this gaming channel after every two days. That means I have posted this. That is today Monday. Next is gonna be Wednesday, then Friday, then Sunday. So this is how it goes. All right, guys. To build the tower, you need to go six blocks wide and six blocks long so that's one two three four five six two three four five six um i mean sorry the width for the tower should be seven by seven so one two three four five six seven two three four five six seven two three four five six seven and two three four five six seven so after that after this is done guys what you need to do is go along your lava bucket and place it along the cobblestone it's gonna be really easy guys look at this all you need to do is this so guys lava might take some time to go down so we need to wait first after the lava has come down i'll wait for it give me a second or so yeah so guys after the lava has come down it might look something like this only a middle block would be empty so now what you want to do is take your water bucket and place it on the top corners so like one now you want to let the water cool down so after it's done you want to take your cobblestone and one and two and three and four there and after the water cools down there might be some broken blocks you can actually fix it with a cobblestone that's no problem so this is the image of the tower right after cooling down of the lava but guys now i thought that this might not be enough so now i'm actually gonna edit the tower in front of you guys to show you guys how to make it look even better what you want to do is leave this empty and open up some blocks like this so you can enter and exit as well and then do like that you know what we'll add that later but for now we need some door I take my door place it like this no wait um gone wrong Need to bring this down. No, um, just give me a second here, guys. Yeah, um, that side's the door. Yeah, it might affect that side. Um, what am I gonna do is now put this back up? 
Yeah, I think that should be the door. Alright guys, this would be the door. And we're gonna make an outer covering so that it looks cool. All is done by cobblestone guys if you want to make a tower in minecraft for the early few days this is the easiest tower i could find and it's super easy to make does not even require a lot of resources and editing this tower is quite easy i mean just look at this so now i did that because it gives us shape and let me just time set day so guys now this gives a, a bit of opening like this now what you want to do is place two oak doors like that and you want to make a form of staircases as well to go up and down you might want to extend that instead of that you might want to place real stairs so i'm gonna actually take some of the stone stair to make it look good now looks good remove that place it like this makes it look good so look at that guys and instead if you don't want that kind of roof you can easily get this kind of roof as well this is the far most easiest roof anyone can make and then if you don't want that design that's completely fine you can just take this uh, design as well works pretty good and I'm gonna place a cobblestone right there look at this guys this is a vera without any resources made and it still works good So I'm just gonna get the outside of this again to make a better of these. I mean that look kind of dull. Covering hole with cobblestone is not a good idea. So you might want to use some stairs. Any stairs you can use doesn't matter. But for this case I'm using stone stairs so that it looks even better. But it's completely up to you what stairs you want to use. It would still look the same. Okay, now this is a hard turn to place a stair on. No, oh, wait. Um, all right, yeah, this is turned. The corners are the most tough part to do but I'm just gonna show you how to do it any which ways and same for the roof guys you can customize it any which ways you want but I'm gonna show the easiest way so that we get some time saved up so guys no one would ever believe that this would made of lava and water I mean, those were the two resources just to make this massive house. You can even do this in the survival mode, but I'm doing it in creative mode so that I can actually finish up this video fast. And guys, what I was planning was I do um, Roblox videos on witness days. And on the rest of the days that I was supposed to do the video. So guys what I'm planning to do on my YouTube now is post more of the gaming videos up here.
I'll explain what I mean later guys it's kind of hard to explain right now yeah I messed this design up here just remove that place it back here place it back here just give me a second guys let me just see how this design was again made already yeah. so now that goes in like there that goes there right that goes there right yeah I did something wrong there so that's that and that's that okay cool um that goes in there so guys I did this just to give it a nice cool design you can customize it in any ways you want but I prefer this because it looks so much easier so now guys what you want to do is wait yeah um so guys now when you go inside your castle or tower or whatever you want to say it wait I just removed my door yeah it could look like this so now what you want to do is go down here and take out this whole area I'll tell you why you have to take this whole area out it can be a lot useful guys so just watch me how I do it and you can do it too it's up to you if you want to do it on or you can just cover it with glass I prefer doing this because it provides some storage down here so it would be kind of a base like down here but it's gonna be good just watch the video guys And guys make sure to follow that like button and subscribe for more videos like these tutorial videos now let's get a move on so guys after you clean this area you get a lot of space to do everything you want I prefer doing is placing down useful materials here so what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna take Um, just a second guys yeah so I'm gonna take smoker and then I'm gonna take blast furnace and uh, now I need normal crafting table and furnace let me just find those you know what so there's the crafting table now we have to get the furnace as well chest anvil so guys what the thing that I did here was um, let me just show you guys in a sec let me just find guys give me a time yeah um so I remember I was here and then I took loom as well yeah so I took loom I exited this now what you guys want to do is place that whole area with furnace so that it gets useful I'll fix that guys just give me a sec yeah so cover that whole area with furnace that's seven blocks it's going to be useful now this side what you want to do is put the looms and now this side you want to put um, the anvil 
I only prefer yeah fill this whole section with anvils or you can place anything else that you want um I mean you can place the stone cutter if you want I mean look at this if I remove one or two of those I place two stone cutters remove one more and then you can place the fletching table or the choreography table cartography I mean sorry there's a lot more you can do just give me a second guys yeah so you can put place that remove that place that there so it looks more useful and more working kind but now this set what you want to do is go ahead and uh, place some smokers and blast furnace I mean what you want to do is what you can either do is place three smokers there one crafting table and the rest with blast furnace now once you have those I placed the anvil at the wrong time guys my bad just give me a sec so once you have done that I might prefer doing this earlier but you have to do the reflooring as well I forgot before placing the anvils but you can do it anytime so I'm just going to do the replacing of the floor So guys after reflooring place your anvils again now you have this area wide open what you can do is take a bed and uh, place it here somewhere in the middle dig down you flow that real quick and then you can place double chests and now guys the reason I took this area out so guys the reason I took this area out was to make an in and out way of the base so now what you want to do is grab a ladder and grab a trap door now what you can do is place the ladder here go up and crouch down place the trap door there so you have it in, in and out of way of your base now what you want to do is get some glass to cover this area up as I said before so now take your glass and cover this 
And guys, do not destroy the glass if you are in survival mode. Because in creative, it's easy to get, but in survival, you need to find sand first. So guys, this is covered. Now we have an in and out of way base as well. Now we are gonna do what every tower has in common. That is, we are gonna make it into a watchtower. Making this into a watchtower will be fun, but make sure. But that will be done in the next video. So guys, that would be it for this one, I think. So guys, if you want to see me converting this thing, this half done tower into a watchtower, subscribe to my channel because I will be converting this into a watchtower on Friday and it's gonna be fun. So guys, make sure to subscribe and I will see you guys in the next one.